Okay. Well, let's get over to the Mod Cave bathroom really fast and do it. And get it done. And then we should be able to come back and it will be around noon. So they'll want to eat again. And also on top of that, they'll want to... Uh, actually, wait a minute. Do I need to buy healing items first? No, we should be fine. We haven't been having that much trouble. Yeah, we'll, we're fine. I need to sell stuff, though. Anyways, uh, yeah, let's go to Mod Cape. We'll get that done. We'll come back, and then I think the fishing hole should be done leveling up. And on top of that, we should also have the... Uh, they should be ready to eat, and I can give them Serafimon's dishes again. Is that the delicate sound of fossilized poop I hear? So bewitching. This is just another normal Sukumon. Gerald Panzer the Silent. Why do they all have these weird names and titles? What? Do my eyes deceive me? Are you the savior? The fact that you are in possession of fossilized poop must mean Puplang is fallen. Though it is pointless to fight at the whim of the Slate of Prophecy, I fear I must do just that. The Slate of Prophecy? What is this? What's the Slate of Prophecy? I shall tell you all I know. If you can beat me, that is. This is so dumb. Oh, this one's level 62. Okay. I didn't mean to press X when I did, but whatever. What are these mega buffs? They must have the upgrade. Uh, I think the upgrade ability is the one that gives all those buffs at once. They're still taking tons of damage, though. Sick. Wait, what happened? Wait a minute, wait a minute. Is Magnodramon down? I can't, I can't do anything during this stupid attack. Yeah, they are using the upgrade skill. He went down, and what's his face? What? How did that happen? Get up, get up, get up. There we go. All right, both of you take a super recovery disc. It must be because of these mega boosts that let them get off a really strong attack. Like, all of them at once got it off. I've got to get you back up to, like, full. I need I need stuff to die right now. Ah, oh, it's using its ultimate. Dang it, that's bad. It's because there are so many of them getting the boosts all at once. That's the problem here. So I've got to, I've got to stop that right now. You're thunderbolting right now. I want you to immediately thunderbolt a second time, if you could. There we go. Okay, I hate this... I hate this. I think that's the ultimate machine attack. I hate it. Because I can't I can't support or uh, do the other thing while it's happening. I can't support or use items while it happens, which is dumb in my opinion. But hey, he's almost he's already at like half health, so we got this in the bag. No, 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 no. Actually, I can, instead of blocking, I'm going to use Fire Drake Strike. I think he aimed at Kaiser Greymon. I hope he did. Because it, it means I'll be immune to this hit. Yep, there you go. I love that if you use your ultimate skill, you suddenly become immune to all damage before launching it. It's great. Unfortunately, he did limit. But he had a lot of HP, so I kind of expected him to. There we go. Sick. Oh, this is basically over. No, 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 no. None of that. I will guard the crap out of it. Alright, so yeah, the only reason we had trouble at the start was because, like, all four of them were buffed with attack boosts and everything else, and they all got to attack. Look at these great stat boosts and tamer EXP and whatnot, though. That's so good. And the bit definitely is really useful. Huh. This fight was written on the Slate of Prophecy, which was found in the Drainage Path, which is where the King Sukumon is. Yeah. It was foolish to fight a war for the sake of a slate not soiled by poop. But it was impossible to resist its pull. Like the tickly feeling one get- No, I'm not reading that. I cannot put a stop to its power. The one who found it, Corellus, resides in the wastelands. Don't expect him to fight fair. Be careful. Savior, though it is not my place to ask this of you, I beg you, stop the king. Farewell. Long live the king. How are you going to tell me to stop him and then say long live the king? The slate of prophecy? The king? Yeah, I know, man. What is this crap? Literally. Five remaining. I see you're done with the Modcape bathroom. Next, head to the Guts Waste in the Wastelands. A cunning individual awaits you there. If anyone can handle this, you can, but make sure to stay on your guard. Ready? Uh, so we want to go to the very entrance of the Wastelands because the toilet is at the top of that hill overlooking the Meaty Troop field, if I'm not mistaken. I think that's where it's at. You have five more autopilots for me? I think you should. Really? I guess I have to do it one, maybe two more times. Is the, whatchamacallit, done leveling up? I'm not going to leave town again until the day cycles. I still got another hour. So we're going to go to the Wastelands before that's done then. Actually, no. We should be able to go to the Wastelands and get it done, like, within half an in-game hour. That shouldn't be a problem. So let's go there then. Yeah. Because this should take me straight to the toilet, if I'm not mistaken. I should be right next to it. I probably should have gotten more healing items. Nah, I think we should still be fine. We'll need to buy some soon, though. 
I need full recovery disc especially. What are these golden Gardramon doing here? Is that a Sukumon behind them? Do they have to do with the main mission? Or I mean with this EX scenario mission? What? Are you the one who saved the land? Forgive me, but I cannot let you pass. Corellus the Venomous. Gwahahaha! <laughs> Can you really defeat this one ear, savior? These Digimon work for ear, ear yours truly, so they can have the right to use the toilet. What? It seems your portable toilets didn't make it this far. Take it to them, my foul, glorious, shining soldiers. So, Savior, do you really think you can defeat them? Are you going to show your hide and run away or just poop your... I hate everything about this. Yeah, you do disgust me. Aha! Such praise. It's music to my ears, of course. Go get them, soldiers. I'll be rooting for you from me toilet. I hate your speech. Okay, so we're just fighting the three Gardramon, and they're all level 60. This shouldn't be too bad, then. You can take it. Oh, they do use, like, filth attacks still, up. though. But they're dying pretty fast. I should just Let's be able go. to spam AoE attacks for a second here and be fine. Ah, oh, you've got a status right. effect. Whatever. Yeah, they're all already at about half. It's not too bad. Oh, is it over? Can you use... Yeah, fighting over. There you go. All right, and then Thunder again. Just keep AoE attacking until they're dead, honestly. Uh, one of them is bulkier than the others, it looks like. Oh my goodness, how did you get so low on HP? They're using this stupid AoE attack. Please get there in time, health. Good, very good. Ah, uh, this poison is probably part of the reason. How many more? I'm going to use the last two full recovery discs right now. To give them health and to get rid of all this uh, confusion and whatnot. Go ahead and throw out another Fighting Aura, please. That one is almost dead. Fighting Aura may kill it. Nope, it's still barely alive. Shake it off. These fights are always the hardest at the very start because there's so many of them. But there we go. One of them is down. So now it should get substantially easier. Yeah, these both are almost dead too. So we've got this. No problem. You can take it. Finish them off. Kill the one that's like almost dead. What, do you, what are you doing not attacking the one that's almost dead? Yeah, there you go. Attack that one. Same for you. Kill the one that is almost dead. Then you can both double team the last one. There you go. Good old Thunderbolt and uh, Fighting Aura always pulling through. Just finish this one off. I shouldn't have to do any shenanigans. You guys got this. That wasn't too bad. It was a little trying at the start, but we got through it. So much money and Tamer XP. I love it. Ah, it appears I've been slain. Corellus, fight in my stead. If you cannot, I shall destroy this public toilet and you with it. Yeah, you shouldn't break the toilet. That's not very nice. We are done for. We are as useless as we were before the contract was signed. I shall unleash the gigawatt laser to destroy both the toilet and you. Ah, wait, you can't just wipe me, the mighty Corellus, out. Soon the Platinum Glory will take the crown and lead the tribe. If that happens, you're finished. What? Toodaloo? He didn't flush himself, he ran. Corellus has escaped. Forgive me, this is what I should have done to begin with. In the Palace of Thorns awaits Skafelt, protector of its toilets and a most hardy warrior. The noblest of sorts, really, who even came here to negotiate with Corellus. Apparently, Skafelt even secretly allowed some of the younger Digimon to use the palace's toilet. If you introduce yourself, you may be graced with the noble's presence. Farewell. Skafelt? I I've heard that name before. Didn't... I think it was Numelfos, the very... I can't believe that I'm actually, like, remembering parts of this stupid, idiotic story, by the way. I think Numelfos told me to, like, tell him something about... Four left halfway there. You're done with the Guts Waste bathroom. My thanks for your help with the Gardramons. I believe you're aware that there are two bathrooms in the Wastelands. The one in Palace of Thorns is your next destination. I actually forgot about Ready? that. But, uh... He said to tell... Tell him something about the king or something. I can't remember. I really don't care. <laughs> I just want this to be done. I've got 10 minutes left. I don't think I'm going to get through four more toilets worth of fights in the amount of time I have left today, unfortunately. We'll have to finish it next time. We'll see, though. I might be able to. But I have to sit here and wait a minute for the time to cycle so I can get Seraphim on to feed these guys. I need the bond up and I need the stat boost. I've definitely been getting enough money to finance Seraphimon's foods. Just five in-game minutes. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Nearly there. Very good. Should be hungry now. There we go. I don't like that Manorjimon got full after just one, but they ate three this morning, so I think that plays a part in that. Anyways, so now I should go to the Wasteland's Hinterland, which puts me inside the Rose Palace. And then we just back right back out. I think. Toilet's just right outside the gates, isn't it? Pretty sure it is.
Let's go deal with another toilet. This gives uh, Digion water, doesn't it? Digion water is fairly high tier. I'll pick it up. Yeah, it does. May as well. I mean, we're, we're going to go right back to town as soon as I get through this toilet, so... Because I'll just fast travel to whichever one is next. Actually, what's next? Faulty X Machina or Boney Resort? Should be one or the other. I guess you're the guy I need to talk to. Skafelt the Thunderous. I believe I have yet to have the pleasure, Savior. You may call me Skafelt. You passed on Numelfos' message. Gadzooks, Numelfos left the secret of the crown with the princess? Oh, no, it was something about the princess. Zounds, the crown's secret phrase was the key to it all. If only I had known sooner. If the secret phrase and the slate of prophecy were different, things would not have come to this. Still, it appears that all this is tied to fate. Things are too far gone to stop them now. I do not wish to harm you, but as a follower of the king, I fear I must, and I shall not hold back. What is- what is happening? Egad, what? I heard you saying bad things about me. This poison will stop you from, bouting, from spouting such things again, Skafelt. I'll be reporting your treachery to the king. You're finished. Toodaloo. What is happening? Darn you, Corellus, you pitiful snake. Is there some kind of an antidote? This is nothing. I can handle it. I am a warrior to the last and as such cannot flee a battle. I, Skafelt the Thunderous, will not be deterred. Why do we have to fight? Level 67? Why? Why would there ever be a Platinum Numamon at level 67? What is this garbage? Also, your guys' health is really low. I didn't heal you while I was back in town and that was a mistake on my part. Damn. Nice. He's taking, like, no damage. I hate this. I hate everything about this. Oh, my goodness. He deals a lot of damage, too. Can you, like, not? Also, the confusion. Could that stop? Do I have any remedy? To yeah, I do have, like, 30 normal remedy to remedy this, actually. So, this won't heal him very much, but it'll, uh, unconfuse them. Guess just try and get order power up as much as I can so I can use, uh, Digifuse skills. This fight is going to take a while. This is probably going to be the last thing we do today is this fight, because it's going to take me a minute to get through all this. Because he's taking, like, he's taking 10 damage from every attack. Why is he so bu- Ah, there we go. That did- Okay. No, that was a crit, though. Oh, my goodness. Their HP is super low. How did I not see that? Heal, heal, heal. Oh, he used his ultimate. That's bad. Rare metal poop. It's just poop toss only silver. Really? Oh, my goodness. That did almost 20k damage. Did you see that? How? Heal, heal, heal faster. There you go. Thank you for guarding him there, Magma Dramon. Very kind of you. You know what, guys? Throw out the ultimate. Ah, oh, you're paralyzed. You can't. Dang it. You can take it. This is ridiculous. Why is this thing so strong? I've got to throw out the Digifuse skill. i got to see some damage. Except they're, they're freaking Remedy Disc here. Take this. Come on, come on, come on. There you go. Okay. Digifuse skill. Please do, like, a ton of damage. I need it. This thing will not die. Look at how bulky he is. Do you just use his ultimate? Please throw your ultimate out first. No, he was just using the tornado attack. Sometimes looks like an ultimate attack. Please do a lot of damage. Oh, yeah, I did a good amount, but he's got so much defense. He's got a ton of HP and a high defense stat. This is insane. Easiest block of my life, by the way. All right, now we're starting to do some good damage, only because we're getting crits. So thank goodness for my wisdom stat being as high as it is. Come on, critical hits. Come on, critical hits. Also, I need to make sure I keep doing the best I can with... Uh... Oh, no, 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 no. I can't use the ultimate. Who do I need? Right, yeah, guard. Not hit me with that again, buddy. Scafold is OP, man. Pliss nerf Scafold. I'm actually starting to run low on MP. This is also not purely because of him being strong. It's also partially because I started with low MP and HP because uh, because I haven't been healing in between each of these fights. I've just been going from one to the other, which is stupid of me. That's that's a mistake on my part. I shouldn't have been doing it like that, but whatever. Come on, use your ultimate. I want to use my Digifuse skill. Yep, there you go. Easy. No, why aren't you Digifuse skilling? Oh, no, you're... Dang it. Wait, wait, wait. Guard. Okay, I got that off in time. Thank goodness. I didn't realize that Magna Dramon was confused. I was trying to use their Digifuse skill instead of blocking normally. That still knocked him back. That's weird. I didn't know that could happen. I didn't know you could get knocked back while also uh, using the defend order. I can't believe I went so long in this game without the defend order, by the way. I should have started using it way sooner. Fire Drake Strike is so amazingly good. I will never get tired of seeing this animation. 
I always want to have Kaiser Greymon. He's officially like my favorite Digimon in this game. You could aim. Just because I love seeing that. Yeah. Right, who are you? You're attacking Kaiser Greymon. Guard it. Ah, oh, he's so close to dead. Can we please just kill this thing already? It's nearly there. Come on, I need some critical hits. You know what? Throw out another uh, fire tornado. Just because I have the points for it. Get him, Magnodramon. Do some good damage. We've been in this fight for like four minutes, by the way. Which is insanity to me. But it's dead, finally. Holy cow, that was stupid. I love the stat boosts and whatnot, though. Hurricane, sick. I know why they call you Savior. My apologies, but it is time for me to bow out. I must go after Corellis. Though I doubt the king would listen to that swine. There may be others involved. You will no doubt encounter Cauriel soon enough. She is the princess of Numamon. That said off Numamon, by the way. <laughs> and when you meet her, tell her I said to flee for the sake of that which I entrusted to her. Our code phrases. This is a most for for I don't know how to pronounce this word. Fortituous? Coincidence. And last night I dreamed we would meet again. Is she like your girlfriend or something? My apologies, but you must do this for me. Finally, if you tell Midorius at Boney Resort that you undid Skafelt, he will probably come out. It is likely that he knows some things. Alas, he and I do not get along, really. Anyway, that is of little importance. I must be going now, Savior. Fare thee well. So, Boney Resort next. It looks like we're three remaining. It seems you completed your test at the Palace of Thorns. Next is Boney Resort, but beware, I, you don't want to travel to the bathroom in Boney Drive at night. Why? Okay, now. All right, so we've got uh, Boney Resort next, and then it sounded like they're going to have us go to Faulty X Machina last because that's where the king is at. So we'll probably go to Absolute Zero after that, and then Faulty X Machina last. But yeah, I've only got like three minutes, and if the next fight is as long as that one was, I'm not going to have time for it. So instead, let's go look at the fishing hold now that it's complete and see if we can start anything else building and do other such things. We need to buy more items and whatnot. It's not done yet. It's got to be done in the next, like... It's got to be done before one, I think. So let's just wait a second here. It should spawn in any second. We're going to finally see this fifth one. It's made of Digi Holy Water. I don't know what color it's going to be. Possibly white? White seems plausible. It's really not going to... Ah, there we go. 1257. That's when it was finished. Entertainment District. Still need to do the Coliseum at some point. Look at that giant golden fish statue. That's sick. No wonder we needed so much material. It's yellow. Okay, that makes sense. You know, light light can be... Uh, you look at the sun. The sun is yellow. Sun is the main source of light in the world. That makes sense. Light can be represented by yellow in some cases. All right, cool. Well, we got that done then. Let's look in the builder and see what we got going on. Also, the fields. I haven't gone to the fields yet today, I don't think. I've been so caught up in this stupid EX scenario that I haven't been doing my daily rounds and whatnot. Thank you for all of that. I don't really have to worry about getting meat to feed them because I've been feeding them at the restaurant exclusively. So, Builder. Have I already talked to... Yes, I have. I've talked to Zudomon and Hagurumon. Okay, Square. We still need a lot of stuff. We need Digi Holy Water all over again. 17 more Digi Starwood. More Digi... Ah, oh, man. We need 45 more Digi Holy Water. That's annoying. Digi Diamond and all that. Digi Rubies, Emeralds. Not so many Emeralds, but the more Emeralds we get, we can convert Emeralds into Rubies. And I think the Advanced Item Shop... No, we need 40 Digi Emeralds for something else, I think, over here. Yeah, 40 Emeralds, 30 Rubies. So, we do need a lot of Emeralds still as well, unfortunately. This needs Digi Lightning Water, but I don't think I'm going to level up the Arena until after the Space Time Transporter is done, because it needs 50 Digi Lightning Water. We need a good bit of red Digizoid as well. At least 30. We need some more blue. Oh, uh, no, we need 55. Holy cow. And red Digizoid is the hardest to get. That's really irritating. Okay, I got like another minute, so let's go buy items then. Do -do. Tentamon, you're maxed out now, right? I think this place is maxed out. I can buy... Let's buy 13 of these, even though they're really expensive. Oh, my goodness. So hopefully we don't need to buy those ever again. I need these mainly. Can I get like 35? Ah, oh, it's so expensive. But we're still, we've still got like three more fights to go with this EX scenario. And the Numamon and Sukumon, if anything, that they're good at, it's giving me a lot of cash. So honestly, buy 10 more. 
We're under 100k, unfortunately. Uh, I'll buy a 17 more of these just to make sure we're good on them. And then I need... You buy the recovery discs and stuff from... Or the remedy discs, I mean, from here, from Cubimon. If I max you out, will you let me buy full recovery discs? Because you're only level 2 right now, right? You max out at level 3, I believe. Also, I should start giving Magnodramon life to Kaiser Greymon to ensure that Kaiser Greymon lives a good while after Magnodramon is dead. So we need to start doing that. Maybe we don't really need to make sure we do it every day, but just every now and then at least. When we remember to, basically. Alright, well. I guess we're done for today, then. When we come back next time, we're going to finish up these EX scenarios with the stupid Numamon. We've only got three more to go. we got to go to Boney, Boney Resort, and then after that, I assume Absolute Zero, and then we end at Faulty X Machina. So we'll try and get that done pretty soon in the next session. That'll be the main goal. After that, I still need Kaiser Greymon to max out his bond. He'll get more bond when he sleeps. He'll get bond if I get any praise opportunities, and he'll get uh, bond every time he eats. So he's going to eat one, maybe two more times today. I think at 18 and then 22 maybe, or maybe just at 22. He'll eat again. That'll give him like an extra two to three bond. Then he'll sleep. That'll give him an extra bond. And then he'll wake up in the morning and he'll eat hopefully three more times. So that'll give him like seven. He'll still be short about four. But we need to get him to where he can EXE. And then when we can EXE, we'll go fight Omega Mon and Alpha Mon. I assume I'll have to fight them. And then... We also need to go through Absolute Zero. We need to find Dianamon. We need to talk to Vidramon and see if there are any other Digimon there that we can that are new there that we can meet and add to the team or add to the to the city. We've only got 59 prosperity to go, and some Digimon give more than just one prosperity. So we have at absolute most we have 59 more Digimon to recruit. Probably less than that. I'd reckon. Probably I reckon. <laughs> That's my Tennessee coming out. Uh, I imagine we'll have at least 30 more to add at the minimum. But anyways, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. We come back next time. We'll do the rest of the Numamon shenanigans and probably go through Absolute Zero and maybe fight Alphamon and Omegamon. We'll see how it goes. But all that aside, thank you, and I'll see you next time. Until then, farewell.